Have you ever thought to yourself, it's like I'm doing a tight five, I hate this. So if you're at all like me, maybe you like Western games, you like that Western setting a lot, you think to yourself, hmm, I could really go for another cowboy game right now, but I, I don't really care to think about the size of my digital horses. Do I have the game for you? The game is called Westerado Double Barreled by Ostrich Banditos. I forget what year it came out. It'll say on the screen. Westerado Double Barreled is a little bit Sunset Riders. It's a little bit Fallout New Vegas. It's uh, Quentin Tarantino directs The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly. To lay out the premise, you're a cowboy, you're on a farm, immediately your whole family is murdered. Your brother is there, bleeding out, he asks you to shoot him in the head to put him out of his misery, and find the man who killed your family. And this, that's, that's the thrust then of the whole game, is finding out who killed your family. And how that works is the game predetermines at the beginning, you know, who, who it is that killed your family. And as you go through and complete tasks and quests for people, they'll say like, well, I heard about the guy that burned down a farm and he was wearing a big blue hat or, or some such like that. And then you slowly begin to piece together who is this person that killed your family and even at the start of the game you can accuse anybody you can be like i know you did it you killed my mom or i can't remember if it's if it's your mom or your aunt i think it's your mom your mom and your brother die your father's already dead you go to your uncle's house you can accidentally kill him when my brother and i played this game back in the day he inadvertently just took out a whole saloon including the piano player which meant that that saloon never had jaunty piano music playing in it ever again there was just no soundtrack it was just ambient noise i, th I think i've done a bad thing <laughs> heinous but that's great because it means there's kind of infinite replayability because the murderer is always different and you're, you're you can't like min max um you can't min max the art of vengeance i mentioned the fallout bits it's got uh, a lot of quests. The map is very big, and there's overworld, and there's like mines and tunnels underground. There's a lot of quests you can do, and you can go and meet with an oil tycoon who's kind of doing all sorts of nefarious, shady stuff, and then you find yourself in a room with an oil tycoon and a gun. The pixel art is great, the animation is great, the gunplay feels good, you have to manually reload every shot that you take. Your lives are measured in hats, so you're, you get shot and your hat flies off. You put another one on, you pick up hats off dead people for extra lives. The soundtrack whips. I meant to get my harmonica out try to play the main theme but i'm gonna i'm gonna not do that yeah just a great little cowboy game westerado double barreled potentially the first of whatever we're gonna call this series here's the title card what would you do if you were alone in a room with an oil baron and a gun uh you know leave a comment like the video and subscribe to the channel i'm jake terrio this has been title of this series Thanks for watching.